Preventing contamination is an everyday task in cell culture. Avoiding contamination is much easier than dealing with it. One of the major sources of germ transfer is you, the person working in the cell culture lab. Wearing personal protective equipment and applying constant aseptic techniques protects not only yourself, but also the cells you are working with. After disinfection, let your hands dry before you start working. Make sure you have everything you need in the biological safety cabinet, but avoid an overcrowded workspace, as the laminar airflow may be disturbed. Disinfect everything that is placed in the biosafety cabinet. The water bath represents a constant risk of germ transfer. Be sure that it is cleaned on a regular basis and add bactericides and fungicides to the water. Thoroughly disinfect every vessel you warm in the water bath. Only open sterile packages inside the cabinet. Work with one cell type at a time and disinfect the work surface in between. Seal packages with remaining products properly before removing them from the cabinet. Ensure easy access to all items in the cabinet and keep a clear workspace in the center of the cabinet. Avoid leaving the incubator door open for long periods. An additional glass door not only allows monitoring the inside without disturbing the chamber environment, it also minimizes the risk of contaminants entering the incubator. New cells are a potential danger to the existing cell stocks. Keep them in a designated incubator until proved absence of contaminants. When working with flasks, Caps can be held in the hand during pipetting, but this requires practice and routine. Sometimes it is necessary to place the cap to one side. If the cap is placed inside down, sterility cannot be absolutely guaranteed. If the cap is placed inside up, airborne particles or droplets can enter the cap. By placing it onto its side, it is not in contact with the airflow or with the work surface. During all pipetting steps, make sure the tip of the pipette does not touch areas that are not sterile. The optimized geometry of the Eppendorf flask not only reduces the risk of touching the neck with the pipette, it also provides improved access to the whole growth area. Unintentional removal of the lid presents a constant danger during transport and handling outside the cabinet. Eppendorf cell culture dishes have a corrugated handling ring that reduces this risk and also makes it easy to transport dishes in stacks. Eppendorf cell culture plates have a lid with support tabs which minimize contact with the work surface if the lid is placed to one side. Thus the risk of germ transfer is reduced to a minimum.
All Eppendorf cell culture plates have a high contrast alphanumeric labeling for fast and easy well identification. A defined corrugated gripping area guarantees safe handling.